Hello, this is Tiffany Michelle, and I have a quick message for the body of Christ. There is safety in being sent. Beware of dangerous altars of the unknown. People who will understand what I'm saying, those who have an ear will hear. We are living in a time where God is rapidly sending out his people to claim territory, to make disciples, to spread the gospel. There's also a very high influx of people who are desiring to be sent. They desire to be sent, but they're not actually sent. There are those who have a heart for God, but don't have the patience to wait on what the Lord is doing for them or doing through them. And so they are sending themselves out to places that they have no authority in, that they have no right to be in. And therefore they are placing themselves in the line of danger of unknown altars. When God sends us to do a work, he is the provider and the protector of everything that is in within that assignment the finances, the, the, the housing, the food, the people. He is the provider and he is the protector. Why? Because it is his will. It is his assignment. He has sent it. So he is obligated to cover it. When we send ourselves, then we open ourselves up to things that we don't even know exist. We put ourselves in danger because we're not aware of the authorities that rule over the assignments, over the regions, over the territories that we're seeking to impact and infiltrate. Get over the, the desire to be seen. Get over the desire to move quicker than the pace of God's grace in your life. Because what you don't know is that there are iniquities in our bloodlines. There are iniquities in our bloodline, and the enemy is always seeking an entryway, an open door, a portal in order for him to attack, in order for him to take us down. So if we have not taken care of that entry point, if we have not submitted ourselves to God, repented and allowed ourselves to be worked on in order for God to provide coverage in that area, then we may get to a space and a place where there is an unknown altar that has authority. And because of the iniquity that has not been rectified in our bloodline, then this, this authority has authority to attack, oppress, depress, impress and seriously seriously take us out so i admonish those that are gearing up for the war that we are in because we are in a war don't run ahead do not run ahead of the assignment if god tells you he's going to send you to a place wait on him do not go before him and as a matter of fact, what we all should be doing is submitting our assignments back to God. Lord, thank you for this assignment. I submit it back to you, Lord, and I await your direction. I follow your path that you have laid out for me, for this assignment, for these people that you've sent me to serve. It is imperative in these last days that we do not run ahead so that we do not give authority to the enemy to his kingdom to attack us and oppress us because of un, undealt with iniquities. There is protection in being sent. Beware of unknown altars. I hope that this serves you. I hope that, the, that, that you heard this. If you are aware of what I'm saying and you understand it, share it, share it with somebody that you know, share it with those who are in the, in the ministry, entering the marketplace ministry, because it doesn't matter what form of ministry you are in, whether you're in the pulpit or whether you're in the, in the office, we must continually submit our work to the Lord and we are guaranteed his protection and his provision. I thank you for listening. That's it. I'll talk to you soon.